Leonard Sesu Shugba was born to the family of Mr. and Mrs. Shugba on the 3rd of November 2005. My name is Leonard Sesu Shugba. I'm 11 years old and I'm from Oshungo Local Government from Benue State. My name is Mrs. Oluwakemi Shugba. I'm Leonard Jr.'s mom. His native name is Sesu Ayokunle. Actually, his dad is a thief man, and I am from the Yoruba tribe. So his name is Ayokunle, meaning my joy fills the house. Junior is a wonderful boy, and um, his birth actually brought me joy. And he was born in Japan. I gave birth to him in Japan. And when I learned that I was going to be having a boy, I was so happy because in the thief land, without you having a boy is like you have not started. He is dark in complexion, tall and a Christian. Junior is a very interesting boy. <laughs> very arrogant at times, but I still love him anyway. He is my only brother and he is very independent. Like he likes behaving older than his age. But it's very good for him. Uh, he's an intelligent boy. He's somehow um, destructive, but also um, nice and also caring too. Leonard is the third child of his parent. His other sibling is Mabel. He hails from Oshango local government area of Benue State. He commenced his academic pursuit at Apti Nursery and Primary School in 2007. He later proceeded to Hansel International School till his graduation today. In the nursery, oh, Junior was crying all day. <laughs> I, I, I had to leave him, but I, I'm sure he cried all day. But when I got back to pick him up, he was happy to see me. The next day, he was excited. He was willing to go back. But when we got to this place, when we got to Baesa, we brought him to Ansel. I haven't heard about the school from a friend, um, Sister Sheyi. And she now told us about the school. We brought him here. And from the interview we had with the people around, they were like, uh, we just got settled that it should be in a nice place. So he started coming. But a little while I found him saying, oh, mommy, I can't cope any longer. It's too tough. It's like I'm, the, the, the pressure is too much on him. He started crying at a point. But we had to encourage him that, no, he will get over it with time. He should just be strong enough and that all will be well. But thank God, um, with time, as, as it is now, Junior will not want to miss a day in school. The name of the first school I attended was Apti International Primary and Second nursery and primary school i cried on my first day in school but my first day in hansel i was excited because everyone was happy they had a new classmate actually i wanted to say this um when he was in grade five i was kind of skeptical or we wanted him to go to grade um gss1 from there but i asked him he wasn't so confident about going to Jesus one and I confirmed from the teacher the, fa the teacher also assured me that I should please allow him to grow into Jesus um, into grade six and then from there he can go to Jesus one and I want to thank God today that he was even this morning I asked him concerning his courage to go into secondary school i i'm so i'm so confident that yes he's so prepared now and he's confident enough to face the challenges in the future concerning his secondary school life and i could see him asking questions about oh is waek difficult is jam difficult i said look let's finish the gss <laughs> let's finish the grade class then we'll cross that bridge when we get there what i like about ansel international school is that we do things ourselves. For example, when we are playing the musical instruments, we do it ourselves. We don't use any artificial sounds. That's what I like about Ansel International School. His favorite color is blue, while his hobbies are music and playing video games. Leonard's future ambition is to be, be a medical doctor. I just want him to focus on God, focus on his education. He shouldn't get distracted by things and he should not forget his family. 
is as he's going to secondary school i want to say to you leona junior that you should be strong be courageous just as you've been and much more because this is a bit another um bridge to cross and i want to encourage him to be more committed in reading his book less games because there are challenges in secondary schools you get influenced easily by friends but you shouldn't look out for that you should watch out for your main goal which is becoming a medical doctor to my parents i say thank you for bringing me to Antel international school to my teachers and all my classmates thank you for being patient enough to teach me for my teachers and for my classmates thanks for being my friends ladies and gentlemen boys and girls i present to you Leonard Cecil Schubert.